Deep in the hills of Meghalaya, a village unlike any other waits to be discovered. This is Kongthong, also known as the Whistling Village, where people communicate through a unique form of whistling instead of using their voices. Today we are in one of the most unique villages over here in Meghalaya, and the name of the village is Kongthong Village. The unique thing about this place is that this place has roughly about 750 people, and everybody has their own unique name, which is a musical tune. So imagine like 750 people. So there are 750 unique tunes which has been made by the people over here for the people over here. He spoke to some of the locals to learn more about how the language works. My name is Feeding Star Concept. Okay, and you are from this village? Yes, I'm from this village, Kongtham village. What's your name? What's your name? It's the whistling kosher that we have that we call in our language is uh, the Jingrai Yaobei. Okay. This Jingrai Yaobei is is a is a mother's love song that mm, the mothers compose the tunes for the newborn's baby. Uh, after uh, maybe in two three weeks, they start to compose a tune for that newborn's baby. Okay. And then after the babies grow up, so she we understand that oh that is the tunes of that baby. Then here in the village, we don't need to call the peoples by the name of the person, but mostly we call it by the Jingwei mm. or babies. What's your name? Kong Tong's whistling language has been used for centuries and is still in use today. We spoke to some of the elders in the village to learn more about the history and culture of Kong Tong. Is there a short version? That is the... the short version. Yes. What's the long version? Then the long version is a. To this mind. Very nice. Mm. We can call people by singing or by whistle also. Okay. Mm. So it's like a lifestyle. Yes, yes, it's like a, our day-to-day -day life. Hmm. Yes. When the people also is died, also this jingwei also we go along with that person. We don't reuse again. Oh. When the newborn babies come, that means the new tunes or the new jingwei baby will come. Your mother kept uh, Zingra Yobe for Narendra Modi. Yes, yes, sir. And what's the name uh, she kept? You remember? Uh, no, I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> My mother still yes, she she remember. Uh, what's her name? My name is Panchai. My Zingra Yobe, uh, uh, my tune that my mother composed me. Oh, that is my tune. Thank you. <laughs>
Why there are so many broomsticks over here? See, sir, in this uh, in this our village, nah. Right. The main crop of uh, our village is the brooms. Okay. So that's why here most of the people say uh, the the broom is the like the, the livelihood of the of the village. Okay. So so you no. export brooms or like? Uh, yes. Yes. Oh, okay. We after we dry it, then we sell it to the market. Okay. This village is uh, bigger than Molino. Uh, yes, sir. I think it's bigger. Yeah. yeah, it looks so pretty. It's like right at the cliff. <laughs> so, what do you guys do here, like in your free time? In your free time, the most of them they go to walk in the field. Okay. Because here yeah, the main is uh, brooms. Then the other crops so we plant it's a uh, pineapple, like jackfruit, orange, then bitternut, bay leaf, then pepper also. Oh, nice! This pepper over here. Yes. Nice. And what do kids do <laughs> when they are not going to school? The kids they just play. <laughs> <laughs> nice. It's a really good vibe. Like it's um, it feels very fresh. Being here. Daily life in Kong Thong is simple and peaceful. The locals work hard and enjoy spending time with each other. Like many traditional communities, Kong Thong faces challenge from modernization and preserving their culture. What's your name? What's your name? Like can you call them? บ้าค่ะเลยอืมเดี๋ยวเอาไว้ให้ค่อยๆเอาไว้ครับพันกู้กู้กู้วันนอวันนอวันกิ้งอีออนวันอายยังอีออนวันนอง <coughs> 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 What's your agenda, you be? What's your zingra yoga? What? what is your zingra yoga? And what is your zingra yoga? And yours? So how was the experience about the village? 
Uh, my experience was good. I was very fascinated by the fact that people here call each other with different tunes. Uh, when I was researching about this place, I came across some videos on YouTube, and I thought people generally do it only for camera. But after coming to this place, I realized that they actually call each other with these different tunes which their moms have given to them. So whenever you are strolling into the village, you can hear people calling each other with these different tunes. It was very fascinating and very interesting. So overall, I loved the village. I mean, it's very different and unique experience, and it's so happy to see that there are such unique places in India. Our journey to Kong Thong has been an incredible experience, full of wonders and discovery. We leave this village with a deeper understanding of its culture and traditions, and a newfound appreciation for the power of communication. चार घंटे हो गए मेरे को इस विलेज में एंड लिटरली आई हैव फॉल इन लव विद दिस प्लेस लाइक आई मेरा वापस आने का मन ही नहीं कर रहा है आई जस्ट गॉट टू नो आफ्टर कमिंग टू दिस प्लेस दैट देयर इज अ गेस्ट हाउस एज वेल ओवर हियर वे यू कैन स्टे दिस विलेज इज लाइक रियली क्वेंट रियली पीसफुल रियली ब्यूटीफुल एंड यहां का जो पूरा वाइब है लाइक यू नो पीपल आर लिटरली सिंगिंग अ लॉट बिकॉज़ दे आर कॉलिंग एवरीबॉडी बाय दैट नेम ऑल्दो वो सुनने में इतना अजीब लगता है बट इट्स एक्चुअली नॉट जस्ट फॉर द कैमरा दे आर यूजिंग इट इन देयर लाइफस्टाइल लाइक कोई भी उठ के अगर इधर उधर अपने किसी को बुलाता है तो अपने वही जिन रायुंग से ही बुलाता है एंड या इट्स अ वेरी गुड एक्सपीरियंस जस्ट बीइंग हियर द एनकरेज एवरीवन टू विजिट कोंग थोंग एंड सपोर्ट द प्रिजर्वेशन ऑफ दिस यूनिक एंड वैल्यूएबल कल्चरल हेरिटेज